The Jawbone Jambox has long since been considered the number one portable Bluetooth speaker. Now, at its $149 retail price, it's rather expensive. And many companies have tried to make cheaper portable variants, but honestly, they don't even come close. That is until now. This is the video review of Bolse's 12-watt portable smart NFC Bluetooth stereo speaker. How's that for a name? Now, as you guys can tell, the English on the box is weird. This is probably a Chinese OEM import. It doesn't really matter where it comes from, but it's not manufactured here in the States. And I don't think the company is United States based, despite their U.S. telephone number and U.S. business hours. I mean, you just read the box and you can tell grammatically that they're not from here. They're not native English speakers. Now, it doesn't really matter because the, the product is great and it sports a $39 price tag, $39.99 with Amazon Prime shipping. So in other words, you can pick this speaker up for just a fourth of the price of the Jawbone Jambox. That's awesome. Now it's basically the same size as the Jambox. It's a little bit longer and it's a little bit shorter, but its construction is essentially similar. Now it does sport some additional cheesy logos that you don't get with the Jambox, and it does have inferior construction, but it does remain rather well built. It has this nice uh, rubbery kind of plastic and a metal front grille. Now, there are some actual advantages to this speaker over the Jawbone Jambox, and I'd have to say that it's the array of buttons on the top. Now, it's a little bit less elegant looking because on this speaker, there are six buttons and the cheesy Bulls logo and the cheesy NFC logo, whereas on the Jambox, you just get three elegant buttons. But because you have more buttons, you have more accessibility. Uh, the jam boxes are very iOS based in the sense that you have to do this double click to go forward, triple click to go backwards, that kind of BS that no one likes. Now, this is an NFC enabled device. And what that means is you can essentially touch your device in pairing mode against the, uh, excuse me, against the bull speaker and it will auto pair via Bluetooth. So if you have an Android phone, you just give it a little tappy tappy and it will automatically pair via Bluetooth to your device. Now it's really cool and it works great, but it's really only applicable for the first pairing session because afterwards the speaker automatically recognizes your device and pairs when it turns on. Now the Bluetooth range is honestly inferior to the Jambox. It's only about 20 feet in direct line of sight. And if you have a wall or glass or really anything in the way, it just throws the whole thing off and goes to crap. So you do have to have a direct line of sight. Now you can run it via the line in if you wish with a non-Bluetooth device or with your smartphone just to save a little bit of power. That's usually what I do anyway with my Jambox. Now this is really where everything shines for the Bulls portable NFC speaker. And that is the sound quality. Sound is great. Mids are distinct and trebles ring clear. Now there's, give me, don't get me wrong, there is a ton of bass and there's too much honestly for my liking. But unlike the jam box, the bass doesn't wash out the whole sound spectrum. It's not just a little vibrating bass box. You do get a rather complete, uh, really it is, it's a complete spectrum. You do get mids and you do get trebles, although the bass tends to take uh, control over the song. Now because of that it also distorts at pretty low volumes just like the jam box. To sum things up, we'll ask a couple questions. Number one, is it more durable than the jam box? Mm, not quite. Does it have a better sound quality? Well, it's pretty close, but it's not quite as good as the Jambox. Does it have better Bluetooth range? Not really. Does it have better battery? No. <laughs> so would I recommend it? And I say absolutely yes. You've seen the title. It says Jambox Killer. Now you might be thinking, why? Why? And here's the deal. It doesn't have to be better than the Jambox because the Jambox costs four times more. You can get four of these things for the price of one Jambox. Now, yes, the Jambox is a better portable speaker, but I consider it a Jambox killer because it's dang close to being as good. While it is inferior in a couple of categories, it really does sound nice. Now, if you're gonna use it to take phone calls, it's not the speaker you want. But if you're gonna use it to listen to music as it's intended, I think it's a no brainer. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, comment, and thumbs up this video. And as always, stay snazzy.